penis. <laughs> well, <laughs> welcome back to the final episode of Dead Space Three. Oh God! Immediately oh, no, launched into an ambush. Laughing at my bad joke or yours? I'm like, I like oh. to think it was mine, but let, we'll see. But I of was course, just, don't tell yeah. us. I was just laughing at the cacophony of noise. I'll just leave it yeah. at that. And, of course, what a better way to start the final episode of this LP with incredulous laughter. That's right. Well, hey, I, I mean, today, at the, we're going to find out the true answer to the cliffhanger. I saw lots of guesses in the thread, and none of them were correct. Thank you for the 25 pages of posts about what the cliffhanger and, entailed. Oh, hey, dan dancing hands are back from Dead Space 2. They are, yeah. They just wiggle around. And look at that. I am I am one ration seal short of being able to buy another DLC pack. Ain't that, the, ain't that perfect. So I actually haven't seen... I, I've kept myself spoiler free. So I'm going to take a guess at what's going to happen, alright? You don't have time. You don't have time. Just wait. Are you sure? Just wait for it. Okay. What? I Hey, this is what I was gonna guess. I knew it. I hate. I knew video it. Games. You didn't see a body. You didn't see the body. I hate. I hate video games. Oh. I saw this coming a mile away. No, I won't. So that that money you said you owed me, see Jacobs? I didn't say that. <laughs> oh. So. But I guessed right, right? You you did. You guessed correctly. You guessed the most obvious twist in the world. Con con congratulations. So there you go. I'm proud of myself. Ellie escaped into a delivery tube, quote unquote, or event, or whatever the fuck she said. I wasn't paying attention. Oh. Well, just reminder Ellie is basically, she's as confident as Isaac, right? Dead Space 2. Like, in Dead Space 2, in this game, not really. She just got lucky. She like, hey, the moment Isaac turned away, she MacGyvered, like, she built the, the escape tube. There wasn't one. <laughs> Once Isaac left, she built one in time to escape the poison flesh-eating oh. gas. At least a got pilot, captured. not an engineer. Yeah, like... But she got captured again. She flew the escape tube out of the chamber. Three statues! Three markings! What's the final step? Hmm... Perhaps I should put the perhaps I should put the markings where they correspond with the the bigger markings directly above this puzzle. Maybe I should fucking do that. I don't know, man. You better double check on game facts. <laughs> no, it, it, it's a Did trap. Did you know that they uh they sold a strategy guide for this game? But it's like, what do you need help with? What do you need for strategy? It's a single page that says. Google Game Facts. <laughs> it's a single page that says play a different video game. <laughs> no, this is Safe Space 3. This is Safe Space 3. To, to the very last, this is Safe Space 3. And of course, the final enemies in the video game. The final enemies in the video game where you fight aliens are humans. Great. Man was the real monster all along. <laughs> the deadliest animal. That's right. Man. The top of the food chain, even when confronted by aliens. Well, okay. Talk about apex predators. Humans consistently put down the necromorph threat. Just saying. Dead space one, two, three, extraction. They do, it's true. We win! Alright, Carver, right, wherever you are. <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I think I've cracked the code. Uh-oh. Wait. Carver is another one of Isaac's PTSD flashbacks. He's still in Dead Space 2 mode. So I, Isaac is having a PTSD flashback of a guy who has PTSD flashbacks. Oh. Well, I've gone and busted my knee open. No! Oh. Skip didn't even make it to the machine! Oh. I remember Wait a minute. My college professor, I what, what, is that, uh, what does that say at the bottom? 
Hang on. Wait. <laughs> Wait, sorry. No. It's all dead space. Sorry, what was that? <laughs> Say again? No. <laughs> Fuck this game. Nah. -uh. We fuck this game. Nah. We got a title drop. It took them three games, but they finally did it. They finally title dropped the game. In the dumbest way ever. So there you go. That's what the title of the series means. It took them three games to get here, but that is what the, the title Dead Space means. It actually means that there is no other living life out there in the universe because the moons ate it all it's all just dead space well if you consider the necromorphs to be like the living dead then all right there technically is living stuff out there go necromorph i'm team necromorph and team ellie and team danik and team norton so the final challenge of Dead Space 3. Whoa, is that Galactus up there? We have to climb our way up to Galactus before he eats the planet, that's right. Oh god. This is cool. It's... It's a unique challenge, sort of. It's a combination of all of the different climbing mechanics all in one. You've got... You've got instant kill bullshit, which is not... which I'm not a fan of. And... You know, you have to dodge the fucking... Fire. I think Mass Effect 1 did the final run-up of vertical surface way better than Dead Space 3 is doing right now. Mm. You know what game I think did even better than that? Sonic Adventure 2. Pulling around at the speed of sound. No, no this, this is the perfect go. time to play the Sonic song. This, this is the best time to play the Sonic song. Do it. I really hate, Please. I hate video games. For all that is beautiful and Altman be praised play the Sonic we'll song. No, we'll do it. We'll do it! We'll do it! Fuck it! Yes, fuck it! <laughs> XP3! <-Base> <laughs> the system works. I'm so pumped right now. Welcome to Dead Space <laughs> 3 with Bill O'Reilly. <laughs> we'll do it live! We'll Dead Space it live! And what bullshit is waiting for us up here? Nothing! Sweet. Oh, hey, Carver, you beat me here. <laughs> I should have gone the way you went. Would have been much easier. Isaac, there's an elevator. <laughs> I Isaac, fine, I'll go. I, I imagine that's what's happening, because Isaac is clearly having PTSD flashbacks and is just ignoring Carver. And I imagine Carver's like, I Isaac, there's, don't do it, don't there's a back door. We can just, fine, I'll meet you inside. You know, there's only one way this game could possibly get worse, and that's if Carver ruined everything at the last second. Oh. He's gonna shoot Ellie, isn't he? What are you doing? You, you got a second chance. If he turns off the machine, we're all dead. Her? Us? Everyone. Don't he makes a good point. There's more than one kind of right. Oh, Carver, you no. fucking asshole! <laughs> you oh, fucking no. you motherfucker! Oh God, oh, God. damn it! Oh, dear. Fuck! Ah! God, I hate this game so much. Oh, fucking! Uh. Ah! Well, look on the bright side. We're all gonna die in a few seconds anyway, so you won't have to worry about it anymore. Here's some bullshit. Check this shit out, too. That's a lot of tentacles. Oh, pff. Danik does Fuck. not ever get his comeuppance. He dies having condemned humanity. It's all going down. Everything. I can't believe that just happened. Wow, so this game is White Knight Chronicles, then. It is White Knight Chronicles. I can't believe that just happened. Go back to Earth space, I'll stay here in dead space. <laughs> You're not the marker killer! You've never killed any markers! No! Dead space 2. Yeah. No, that, 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 wasn't, that wasn't marker killing, that was ghost of dead girlfriend killing. 
it's his and, fault the sprawl blew up, oh, right? Oh my god, are they playing romantic music right now? Oh, it gets worse. Oh. I hate you. I hate this game. I hate life. I hate the universe. <laughs> this game's I, beautiful. I want to die. This is a beautiful video game. This is the I'm worst so video this game. This goddamn touching. Oh. This game rocks. At least okay. Isaac they... acknowledges that it's a suicide mission. But he did that in Dead Space 2 as well! Yeah, I know. And, okay, I guess Ellie just, like, teleported into the cockpit of the dropship yeah, then. Yeah, she's magic. Whatever. She's a pilot. She can teleport into, into space cockpit. Cock cockpits. Cockships. <laughs> she's driving a cockship. I was gonna say, Ellie's quite Damn! good at finding space cocks between Isaac and Carver. Chapter 19 is called Endings. That's a little bit on the nose. Convergence? The prologue is called Beginnings. Alright, this part is pretty cool. This is, this is pretty cool. If you, if you dilly-dally for too long, you'll die. Like, you'll just get sucked up into a vortex or something. It reminds me of Purgatory and the new Devil May Cry. It, it is kind of like that. It's got that same kind of feel where, like, geometry just changes at will and means basically nothing. I like that Isaac's yeah. just in a- he's just in a big gravity well right now. Like, he's probably running upside down. <laughs> no, I like that he and Ellie patched things up. I am fucking pissed about that. I'm fucking- <laughs> I am- This, like- I told you guys when we started doing this that this game would just get dumber and dumber after a point until it reached peak dumb right at the end. And there you go. That's peak dumb. That's how dumb it gets. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that you stuck through 21 episodes of this game just for the game to spit in your face like it just did. I like it. Well, in all fairness, you know, if I was about to die it's a space in a... space opera. Yeah. Yeah, in all fairness, if I was about to die on a suicide mission, I would probably tell the closest person within arm's reach of me that I love them too, so, you know, whatever. I got the feeling that Isaac never really got over her. Boy, they're gonna feel silly when they solve this whole thing. Just... I don't even want to fight this alien, but it'll kill me if I don't. So I have to at least stun it. I gotta do a stone-cold stunner on the alien. <laughs> This is kind of comparable to Mass Effect in a way. Like, the like, it's got that sense of finality about it, you know? Like, they make no bones about the fact that there is no going back from where Isaac is going right now, because you're basically flying to the moon. Except they don't draw it out for a solid hour like they do in Mass Effect 3. <laughs> That's right. I want to play that right now. We're gonna put some class into this episode. There, see? That's what the fucking flying things do. They oh. knock you off course. Great. Man, this is like a traditional hero story. Isaac gets the girl, saves the day. Like, this is good. This is the story of our lives. I hate this game. This is the human condition. This, he's about to kill a moon god, too. That's this right, is he is. all stories. Moon Zeus. He's about to <laughs> kill Moon Zeus. Yeah, the... Yeah, that that is the final nope, the final you. boss of Dead Space 3. Zeus comes back for vengeance. <laughs> this game is so Grecian. Oh. This game is a Greek myth. I love it. It's, it's well, it's certainly epic, that's for sure. Not since the Odyssey has the tale been so comparable and massive in scope. That's right. Remember that? Remember that time in the Odyssey and the Iliad where they fought the moon. I remember that. Ajax no, broke it in half you. with his hammer. Fuck you too. <laughs> I don't even care about these necromorphs anymore. God damn it! They just oh won't no, let me not go. Myths. They won't make it easy on me, even in the final moments. Fuck you, and fuck you, and fuck this game, and fuck everything. I'm just so done with it. I'm so done. Here's another parallel. The game started on the moon, and now the game's gonna end on the moon. 
That's right. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Symbology. That's that's unitology. That's right. Symbology. All be praised. Unitology. Urology. Scatology. Scientology. I hate the elite suit. Red space has it all. So I'm going to change into a much better suit to end the game on. Mass Effect. Put the Commander Mass Shepard effect. suit back Mass on. Suit. Commander Shepard. No, riot suit. Riot. Riot. Where's my fucking riot suit, damn it? Mass Effect suit. And seven. Nope. Aww. The engineering Ooh. suit is the series staple. It would make it makes sense to end the series on the series staple. Come on. <sighs> I was gonna let You're the being as predictable code. as the game yeah. now, C. Jacobs. You are playing into the game's hand. It, at this point, it it's just I'm so ready for it to be over. <laughs> yeah, like, what the hell does Isaac have to engineer on a bio recombinant moon anyway? I don't know, but the suit is His cool anyway. His escape so that he can go back to Ellie's loving embrace. That's right. I don't even have anything to buy at the store. Because I'm one ration seal short of getting another fucking scope. <laughs> Blood moon. Blood moon. Ooh, spooky. Oh, fuck! Oh, oh. Oh, that's not good. Oh, Isaac, you're looking kind of... You're in bad shape. So in co-op, would Carver still be here? Yeah, that that's a co-op button. You have to both press that at the same time. Oh, I love. I like this part. I bet you Carver's already there. He, Isaac, why are you running down this corridor? There's there's a back door to the moon. Yeah, Carver. Fine, actually, I'll take it. I'll see you there. You, you joke, but Carver actually is already there. What? Yeah. <laughs> did he take the frickin' elevator? <laughs> yes, he did. No, Isaac. Really, there's a back door to the moon. It says back door to the moon. I can imagine him muttering to himself, like, "Am I the only one who sees these?" He's like, he's breaking the fourth wall. He's seeing the. The, like, the director, like, backstage access. That's right. To the moon. This is fucking cool. I like that they oh. have you, like, slowly approach on the giant moon, and you don't get a scope of how fucking huge it really is until you get oh. right up in its face. Quite literally, I see. Oh my god. We are playing Majora's Mask. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Play the song of time, Isaac. Go back to before this game happened and don't play it. <laughs> so this is it. This is a point where Isaac throws away the mask. He's no longer a cipher. He is the hero. That's why you need to see his face. Because the hero, our David, must slay Goliath. That's right. So this is it. The, the final boss of Dead Space 3. That, that the giant moon. googly eyed looking freak ass thing, yeah. Just I like the googly eyes. Shoot. That's yeah, right. shoot it in its giant pet rock eyes, please. We unfortunately can't do that. Doing that Aww. makes it bleed copiously, but it doesn't actually <laughs> hurt the thing. To actually hurt the thing, we need to pick up the tiny markers floating around with our fucking super kinesis and shoot it right in the eye so that its eye oh explodes. Ah. Uh, this is a really good game. Okay, but I gotta say, like, the big round eyes... Oh my god. <laughs> what? Hmm? Wait, wait. It is David and Goliath. The stasis is the sling. It the markers are the stone. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Things just go biblical. That would be crazy. Actually, we're playing. We're still playing the Binding of Isaac Clark, and Isaac is fighting Mom's heart right now. Oh no! Well, with those giant googly eyes, the thing does look disturbingly cute for a final boss. It does. I know. I noticed that. It's it's so cute. That's the weird flesh flower mouth that pops out of the side of the of the dog thing in the thing. Even to the very end, they're throwing in references to the thing. Also, if we're going back to the Odyssey, he just poked out the eyes of the Cyclops. Like, oh, who, who took out your eyes? No man, no man did. It was Isaac. Isaac did it. By the way, there are special necromorphs in this part. They're uh, the Scaff guys. They're special Scaff-suited slashers. 
and they basically can't be hurt with gunfire. Like, you can kill one with your guns, but it takes a long time, even with my super overpowered weapons. So it's good that I have the Kinesis that allows me to instantly kill them by yanking their limbs off while they're still living. I don't know what the point I is. I just want to say, Isaac's story is all of our stories. I mean, not really. <laughs> He's the little guy fighting the big faceless conglomerate. He's standing up for the rights of to be oppressed. Although would take away who were the impressors that would take away all their things. I mean this this big thing would devour an entire planet and, and only Isaac stands up. Yeah but well and Carver human being. Yeah. <laughs> Carver doesn't Carver. really exist, come on. And plus <laughs> the big the big faceless conglomerate actually has a face. We've been shooting at it for the past five minutes. That's true. We have. He's got you there. Its face, it's its like Legion, right? Like, I am Legion. It has a million faces. They don't mean anything. They are together. I, I like that its eyes cast, like, a light on the, the inner walls of its own fleshy body. Like, that's kind of weird. Like, what, are the, what purpose do the eyes on it even serve if they're inside the mouth? Huh? Oh, I tried to do a bank shot, but it didn't work. Oh well. Smile, you son of a bitch! <laughs> that is pretty cool. I imagine that's probably a gameplay caveat so players can sort of figure out where the last eye is. Like, oh, we're slight shining. Oh, there. Probably. It looks really cool, though. But, oh no, now we're fucked. Because it's fucking just eating the machine. Well, roll credits. <laughs> Great. And what? Isaac has x-ray vision? Nope. For the end of the game, we have to fucking kinesis the platform out of this thing's stomach. Oh, Fuck God. yeah! Fuck oh, yeah! And, oh. And is Carver is on the platform? Carver on the platform? Yep. Yeah. I told what? you. I told you he was waiting there for us. Oh, it's Goatsy. Yeah, uh, so that, that's cheating if you oh, just wow. got sucked There's straight no to the joke. moon on the on the place where you were standing originally anyway. Here's the, uh, the ultimate insult. The final thing you do in Dead Space 3 is a QTE. <laughs> and this game is awesome. So this is it, huh? You just this ripped out, uh... Carver on a platform out of an alien moon's stomach. Oh, Isaac's head is not oh. looking so good. Yeah, like, somehow Isaac is bloodier than Carver, and Carver just emerged from a literal bloodbath. Oh. Was that Isaac's brain, or just a clump of hair? It was his skull. He's got skull showing at this point. He's really mm. fucked up. Ugh. Oh, 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 fuck! Oh, oh. Well, we knew it was coming. Damn. Oh, oh fuck oh. you. Why do you still have that? <laughs> because Dead Space 3 and B lets it go. Bye bye, Ellie. He's letting go of his relationship with Ellie. It's metaphorical. He should have used stasis on the moon. Yeah, he should have. You're right. Fuck you. Yeah, the moon didn't have to die. Fuck you too. <laughs> and look, it's the first time we see that the rig that it is true. The rig actually is attached to a person's spine through their skin. So there you go. The question has been answered. Jeez, that's gonna hurt. Isaac. I'm sure they used anesthetic. I'm sure they didn't just plunk it on. Isaac. Also, Here, bite onto this belt. Come nice touch that Ellie's rig is yellow. Isaac. Yeah, she's got missing health. Gone. Gotta have her in a low-cut top for the ending. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. Maybe her shirt is color-coded, too, because when you first see her, <laughs> her rig is red and her top is red, and now her rig's yellow and her top's yellow. Wait. We did it! 
Yeah! We Yay. stopped the fucking Necromorphs! Yes! Oh, thank God! I fucking... Like, at least they grant you that, right? At least... <laughs> at least... At least they don't immediately ruin that in the DLC. I'm playing the music from The Last of Us here, because it's much better than the generic hard rock that actually plays here. <laughs> So that's it. That's Dead Space 3. What do you guys think? So on a, on a, on a scale of 5, see Jacob. Not even on a scale of 5. We're not rating this on a scale of 5. <laughs> Just tell me straight up. <laughs> what do, <laughs> what do you guys up. think of this game? Having seen the whole thing. Now? Okay. A one being taking no, a cheese grater to we're your face. No, we're not doing it. We're not no. doing it. I refuse no. to rate no. the game on a scale of 5. This yeah. game does not. Well, this game denies. It denies being rated on a scale. You can't rate this game on a scale, because depending on where you are in the game, the rating will change. It will be a one, then a five, then a negative twenty, then a five, then a one. At the end, it'll be a one. Well, I think you could rate this game on the Richter scale because it certainly rocked my world. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh god damn it. So is, is that your is that your piece on Dead Space 3? Is that what you think of it? It's my final answer. Wow. For good or bad it it rocked my world. There you go. Crow, what do you think? Well, that that's the thing like I would imagine that if I was actually like sitting down and playing it myself, I might have a different opinion of it. But just from like watching it and listening to your commentary has really colored a lot. <laughs> of, like, what I think of the game. But... It, it's true. Playing it and watching it is different. Mm. That's true. Yeah, I... You know, I will give you that, yeah, it got really goddamn stupid near the end. It did. That's true. But, mm, but yeah, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm torn on it s still. That's fair. That's fair enough. Because, like, like I said... My, my personal opinion on the game is that it is a good game, but it's also on an equal amount a bad game. It's, it's, the gameplay is fun, and it doesn't overstay its welcome too much, as long as you don't play it in one fucking ten hour session like me, like an idiot. It doesn't overstay its welcome too much, and they basically perfected the action side of the action horror part of the the, the dead space genre the problem though is that the game strayed so far from its roots that you basically could call this a different thing and it wouldn't be a dead space game at all because they, they turn the necromorphs into zombies they're basically just zombies in this game and that kind of sucks the, they took the f dead space one and two have good stories not not great stories not like fantastic stories but good, serviceable, especially for a video game. This game's story is fucking terrible in all possible in all possible ways it could be terrible. But it's so bad that I've gained an appreciation for it, you know? So that that's that's my feeling on the individual parts of Dead Space 3. The graphics are incredible, the music is great, the story is so bad it almost brings the game down with it and the gameplay is fun it's the same old fun that it's always been but man that ending though right I well, think they took it to, look on to the suitably epic levels and look at it this way now Isaac gets to spend the rest of eternity duking it out with the PlayStation All-Stars <laughs> He, he's ascended to a higher plane of existence in the PlayStation 3's quad-core processor, so it is a happy ending. Wow. It's, I guess, in a way, it is a happy ending after all. Safe also, Space 3. Wait, wait, wait. We just missed it. One of the lead artists in the game was named Peng Wu. I think we just saw oh, the mystery man. of Peng. Holy shit. The art of Dead Space 3. 
was Peng all along. My god. <laughs> Man. It's hard to believe that it's over. It's been a wild ride. Uh, it's It's been a lot of fun. I, I think that... I think that overdoing this, I gained, like I said, an appreciation for the game that I didn't have before. I'm glad that I have other people to make fun of it with. Because just making <laughs> fun of it by myself... Is that fucking Steve Bloom? Yeah, it God sure is. Every video Steve, game. Steve Bloom's in everything. God damn it. I don't think Steve Bloom is in Killzone. Look it up on IMDb. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna do that right now. <laughs> He's not confirmed. Oh wow. So uh, the credits for this game are 25 minutes long because it's an EA game, and EA uh, EA always credits every fucking possible person, and the credits in this game scroll particularly slowly. This is sped up to the maximum amount that Sony Vegas would let me speed it up. What? Yeah, this is sped up like like fucking almost six, six times. Oh my god. And they're still like almost ten minutes long. Still, that, so, that's the thing. If, if this was an Ubisoft game, the credits would be going by this fast and it would still take half an hour. <laughs> so, the, uh... There's something I learned, however, very late in the credits, and you guys will see this, but the viewers won't see this. I'll fix it. I learned that if you press down on the D-pad on your controller, does not work on the keyboard. I had to do this on my controller that I had connected. Uh, it will speed up the credits. I didn't know that. I didn't know you <laughs> could do that until almost the end of the credits. But the problem is that doing that makes the credits unreadable because they scroll by faster than the uh, the marker script can be translated. So you can't actually read the credits. See? Uh, okay, yeah, see, there you goes. go. I just did it. Oh. <laughs> see, look, now you can't actually read the credits. So Yeah, suddenly it's a credits gag from a Simpsons episode at this point. <laughs> so I'll, I like credits that have laser schmup. I, I wish this game had a credits a credits sequence game thing. That would be great. Yeah, like the one from New Super Mario Brothers where you you can attack the people like the credits like with as the characters. I was thinking of like Vanquish, but sure. <laughs> well, in in editing, I'm just gonna use stasis on the credits. There you go. <laughs> nice. I'll slow them stasis down. Stasis solves everything. Stasis solves everything. Except for Norton's completely unavoidable death that that hist it will go down in history as the most unavoidable villain death in a video game. Bullshit. <laughs> oh god damn it. Leave a comment on this thread zone if you agree with C Jacobs. I like or this Anger Crow. I like I like this this song. I cut back to the Dead Space music here because they're playing the main Dead Space 3 theme, which is cool. I, I, I think that's a nice way to end the credits. It's Wait. too bad they don't have like a fun hard and hard. Like Escape from Dark Athena style <laughs> credit song. Hard, hard. I wish they put in like fucking like 8 bit music. <laughs> but yeah, you can't even read these thanks messages, and they're actually the funniest part of the credits. Yeah, good riddance. Well, but we haven't gotten to the stinger yet. We the stinger is coming up, and boy, oh, and boy, will it entice you for the Three DLC? <laughs> Isaac's not dead. Here Boy we go. Morphs aren't dead. Is it Thanos in the cosmic cube? Ellie. See you next time. All of them be praised. Zeus did nothing wrong! <laughs>